Men who have been through divorce. Why did it happen? Story one. I made a bad decision regarding who I chose to marry. Story two. She cheated, but our marriage anyway. I'm glad she snapped us out of it somehow, or I'd still be swimming through life in a depressed fog. It's been one year since the split. Things at first, but I am much happier now and feel like the affair was a gift. Nothing good gets away. Steinbeck. Story three. I caught her cheating while I was shopping for vacation packages to Bali to celebrate our upcoming 25 wedding anniversary. Needless to say, I saved some money on the trip, but had to sell a farm and trucking company firing 16 good men to get rid of her. Story four. I became an short-tempered workaholic who failed to be a proper husband. That created a woman who resented me for having her carry the burden of raising kids and working. Story five. First marriage, she was 19 and I was 22. We were too young to know what we wanted out of life. Yet, and after almost 10 years and two kids, realized we weren't compatible. Kids are grown, she's been remarried for 20 plus years, and we're all great friends. Second wife basically boils down to economics. She wanted a rich guy and my business collapsed in 07, and she left. Rumor is that she found a new rich guy and is happily remarried. Story six, going through it now. We just drifted so far apart as people to where we weren't even friends and were just roommates who didn't like being around each other, ever. The garden never got watered and nothing is left to work on. All we have in common is sharing custody of a kid, bit we're doing it amicably, so it'll be fine eventually. Friends, before we continue our video, I want to remind you of the importance of subscribing to our channel. We are also waiting for your comments and likes. Thank you. Let's move on to the video. Story 7. Filed for divorce. Three months after I got married, left for a four-day business trip and came back to a note from my daughter asking me to check the nanny cams. The woman who was sweet and doting on my daughter for two years turned on her after I left. She started with verbal abuse but didn't stop. It was the most heartbreaking thing to watch. I kick at her out of the house that night. I call it a doctor and counselor for my daughter. I called an attorney first thing Monday. I had a prenuptial, and she had the gall to ask for the stipulated payout. I told her attorney I have evidence of the accused abuse. She dropped it and signed the mutual dissolution. I still sent the evidence to the police and pressed charges. Story eight. It's never one thing. It's always a million things a lot of people don't want to talk about. For me, my ex was unhappy with everything in our lives, and because she was unhappy, she made it impossible to be happy around her. I was miserable. She cheated on me once. At least, that's what I could get from the conversation, as she never admitted any wrongdoing. I think she didn't contradict my statement when I said, you cheated, didn't you, to get me to divorce her. She just threw her phone against the wall and cried as acknowledgement. I told her I wanted to work it out. Not too long after this episode, she just came up and said she wanted a divorce. I took two seconds and then casually said, okay. She was shocked that I wasn't emotional at all. The next day, she said, you're letting me go too easy. To which I responded, am I? She's someone else's problem now. My big problem is that I have really been enjoying the peace and tranquility of the solitude that has lasted 16 years, I really don't think I'll go back to wanting a relationship like that. I only married once, but that was enough to know that I don't ever want to do that again. Story 9. X wanted me to be a person I was not. Rejected me when I became that person. Story 10. My grandparents married in the 1950s because my grandmother was Catholic and couldn't have s without being married. After 40 years of being miserable together, my grandfather left and remarried. She never did, though. This is a good note to end on. Please write your stories in the comments. I'll be happy to add them to future videos. Also, you can rate our other videos. We would be very grateful. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.